Hi, hello, Memory here. Do you remember the time when Kokomi got released for the first time? And you thought that she's so bad and she's not worth it to wish for? Oh, you did! Twice now? <laughs> oh my god. I thought so too. Hi, hello, Memory here. Kokomi sucks. I oh, know, boy, she's not good. Oh god, she really needs a lot of buffs. Okay, in my defense, a lot has changed ever since Kokomi existed in the game. And one change that is very, very obvious in this matter is that after I made the video about how bad Kokomi is, Hoyoverse decided to make an artifact set, which is the Ocean Hood Clam that is designed for her, and other things that made Kokomi a much better character. Like, what the heck? I legit felt like Hoyoverse was laughing at me for making such a video. And now, I am also getting hated in the comments now that she's back. But speaking of, Kokomi's banner is back, so... Is she really worth it now? To be honest, Kokomi is worth it to wish for now. And I believe my answer is relevant because most of the players are not whales and instead casuals. And I also happen to be a casual gamer. Just just ignore my Yaimiku constellations and my Amos bow rank, okay? I, I get lucky sometimes. Like look, my Kokomi doesn't even have the everlasting moon glow that I tried so hard to get last time, so... Yeah, I am a casual gamer guy person, man, dude. I really, I really tried so hard to get that freaking weapon last time it was available. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I oh yeah, we're worried. Again, Kokomi is really worth it now. She's great. She's, she's, she's great. Um. <sighs> okay, I really want my Kokomi to have moon glow. So let me just wish for a minute. I can feel it. I can feel the moon glow coming. Yeah, it's coming. It's coming home. My Kokomi is finally gonna have moon glow. <sighs> Classic. You got me again, Hoyovers. Oh wait, moon glow! I now have two fate points, but no premium gems to use it for. Haha! -ha, I hacking love Genshin. So yeah, Kokomi is a great character. But you might ask, memory. Which should I go for? Kokomi or Ganyu? Ganyu. Like dude, it's not even a question. Ganyu is super overpowered ever since she got released. Okay, but seriously, it depends. You need more damage, wish for Ganyu. You need more heal, wish for Ganyu. Because you know, you will have more health if the enemy is already dead. Aside from constellations, the performance of the characters also depends on your weapon and the artifacts that you're gonna give. So. Just, just be lucky, you know? Unlike me who have 1,500 artifacts and none of them are freaking good. You might ask, Memory, are you gonna wish for any of these characters? No. I'm not a stupid guy person, man, dude. I'm not gonna waste my premium gems on any of these stupid constellations. Ya boy is all in for Nilo. <laughs> but really, it's because I just wasted my premium gems trying to get the everlasting moon glow for this video, but I didn't get it with the premium gems that I had. I love this game. Oh.